Mount Fuji at sunset, as seen from my hotel window in Tokyo. In Japan, Fuji is more than just a 12,388-foot pile of dirt. It's also a power spot. These are special places that fall into three broad categories. Natural wonders, such as mountains like Fuji, waterfalls, rivers, hot springs, etc. Then there are shrines and temples, and relics and monuments. Many Japanese visit these places seeking spiritual rejuvenation, physical healing, good fortune and love, business and school, as well as general overall happiness and peace of mind. I checked out a few of these places in Tokyo, including one where people stroke the statue of a cow for good fortune. I also stopped by a Shinto shrine that's home to Kiyomasa's well, a famous healing spot. There, visitors line up to snap a quick photo with their cell phones, believing that the image, when used as a screensaver, brings good fortune. But each time I leave these small islands of calm and hope, I'm thrust back into the frenzy of 21st century Tokyo, a city of almost 13 million. So the search for external as well as internal serenity takes me north to a spot known as Hell's Valley. The ominous fiery name is a tribute to the natural steaming hot springs that in reality make this power spot a paradise for the snow monkeys that live here. Snow monkeys, or Japanese macaques, are the most northern dwelling non-human primate. We usually think of monkeys as living in tropical jungles, but these guys are north of Nagano, a city that hosted the Winter Olympics. No wonder that every day they gather to soak in nature's hot tub. The snow monkey's fondness for a hot bath attracts photographers from all over the world, which has probably resulted in these monkeys being even more photographed than the bunnies in the grotto at the Playboy Mansion. So this power spot has without question worked for the monkeys, making them celebrities, and it would appear it has also made them contented. But what does it do for humans, besides offering the fun of watching a barrel full of monkeys? Well, in the nearby city of Yudanaka, there are hot springs where humans can also bathe and absorb the relaxing and healing benefits of these waters. I would show you the footage, but since those bathers were naked and I was one of them, it's just better for all concerned that we only look at the monkeys and enjoy the moment. <laughs>